welcome Governor Baldacci, Representative Pingree, Administrative Zabo, and distinguished guests. It is my honor and pleasure to welcome you this morning to celebrate the Downeaster expansion from Portland through Freeport to Brunswick. Today's event is another milestone on our quest to provide transportation choices as well as significant economic benefits, including jobs to the entire region. Just as the Downeaster has been a model of success to show how an efficient, effective railroad can operate in this country, so too will our construction project be that. There's tangible proof, folks. This is really going to happen with what is probably the most, forget shovel-ready, spike-ready project in the country. When you think about the cars and trucks on the roads, the congestion, the pollution that's on the road, the waste of energy and, and lack of efficiency because of the need for truck transportation because we don't have enough adequate, efficient rail support. This is the road that we need to travel and we're doing it today. In January, President Obama announced that Maine had been awarded $35 million in American Recovery and Reinvestment Act funds and that the Northern New England Passenger Rail Authority uh, was to receive those dollars. And less than six months later, we're able to allocate those funds to Maine here for this project. So today, on behalf of the President of the United States and the Secretary of Transportation, I'm honored to be here to speak at Brunswick's official groundbreaking. This is good for the economy, and it's good for the culture and romance about Maine. We've talked about the fact that we have 200 jobs that will be created with the rail system, and I'm very excited to see the hardworking people who are going to be actually laying this rail for us. So thank you to all of you. Today's groundbreaking is noteworthy not only because it marks the use of $35 million in our funding distributed here to Maine for this project, but also because this state has demonstrated such a significant understanding of the process that is necessary to expand rail. Maine sets the example for other states. And that's why you're going to be the very first of the Ara Rail projects to put rail into the ground. Engine 516, okay, okay to go, go ahead. ahead. <laughs> 